1829, Catholic Emancipation Act by Rachel Gadsden. I'm really interested in making sure that every single voice is heard in Parliament and the banner that I've created actually represents more than one religion. It's obviously key to the Catholic Emancipation Act and when Catholics were able to sit in Parliament for the first time, but actually as you go down the banner you'll see that there's other religious denominations depicted within the banner and eventually the final figure on the bottom right hand corner represents atheism and so every single religion could be represented within the Houses of Parliament. I think what's really critical about the banners that are being displayed in Parliament, mine alongside the other 17 banners, the most critical thing is the fact that within each of the banners, and mine as well, the whole story and the history of Parliament is represented. And what it gives an individual who goes around the exhibition and sees is that lots of different things have made a huge difference. These acts have made a huge difference to our lives. And as we move forward to the future, there'll be further acts that are represented that show that people actually do have a voice within the parliamentary system.